Hello, I'm Richard Zadomenici, inventor of the Redux project. Redux. When the crowd say ball. Director. The Redux project started by mistake in 2013, after my low-budget remake of scenes from a Bangkok rom-com received better reviews than the original. I tried it again in Glasgow, and the same thing happened. Since then, I've made more than 60 Reduxes around the world in the original locations, with the ultimate intention of destabilizing Hollywood by making cheap versions of derivative blockbusters. This summer, I plan to Redux one of my favorite Newcastle movies, Get Carter. Today, as part of the Remake or Take project, we're researching some of those locations. And here are my top 10 tips for remaking your own northern movie scenes. Don't use a tripod. It's slower, often requires permission, and many cameras and editing software now have built-in image stabilization. You don't have to star in your own remakes. When I stopped featuring in my reduxes, length of them suddenly doubled. However, I do still try to make the occasional Hitchcockian cameo. Do as much preparation as you can. I use Google Street View and Apple Flyover to find locations in advance, which saves valuable time during filming. Be prepared, but also be prepared to improvise. Not enough performers? Ask a passerby. No costume budget? Ask a vintage store if they'll lend you some clothes in exchange for their logo in the credits. Non-financial microtransactions. It's the way forward. Beg, borrow, but do not steal. Film and edit quickly. More than three takes and you're probably doing it wrong. Sorry, Stanley Kubrick. I love you. This will save you time in the edit too. There's no such thing as perfection. Behind me is the site of perhaps the most famous Get Carter film location, Trinity Square multi-storey car park. Demolished in 2010, chunks of it were sold off as memorabilia, and I hope that by finding all of those chunks, I can somehow put them back together again to remake the car park scenes. So, never give up. Use technology to speed things up. Long piece of dialogue, use hidden headphones to lip sync. Long distance shot, use mobile phones to communicate. Back up your data, every night at least, especially when you're about to film a scene standing in the sea in the winter time and your camera isn't waterproof. Maintain situational awareness. Ask somebody to spot you whilst running backwards. <laughs> Try not to get run over whilst looking into the viewfinder. Too much traffic? Use green screen miniatures instead. And finally, never run down an escalator in stilettos. Don't forget to have a premiere and an after party. It's a great way to thank everybody for getting involved. And my last piece of advice is not to take any of my advice.